Hey traders, Bob with Currency Waves. Going to take a look at the Aussie Yen. Quick, this is a weekly Aussie Yen chart, and I have one, two, three, four, five for an A complex B wave up, and we have one, two, three, four, five for one or oops or an A wave here. I think it's a one, but it is possible it's an A. And same thing here, we have a wave two or a B. And we're working on wave one of three or C, of course. Just throw that on there quick. And if it is, it would probably end at 83.88, but I'm looking much lower than that long term. Um, right now I see a one, two, three. This is a wave four. Working on wave five. Here it is on a daily at one, two, three, four. Again, working on five. Looking for 93.60 for wave five. A couple of notes here. Sideways wave two. The wave two retraced to the 50% of wave one. Wave three was 200% of wave one. And because wave two was sideways wave, wave four, we got a sharp wave four, if, if this is correct, in calling this wave four already. Um, and it retraced 50% of wave three. Again, basically the same thing here. We got the one, two, three, and the four on the four hour chart. The one, two, one, two, working on a possibly a wave three. On the hourly chart, just going from this 98.26 high, I have this label as one, two, three, four, five. Then you got like an A, B, C up for a two, one, two. And this is where it kind of gets tricky right now. You could go with a one, two, three, four. And then you're working on an extended fifth wave of this wave three. Um, you could go with one, two, three, four, five ending here. This is a two, and it's just starting a longer wave three. So I'll have to see how that plays out. But right now I see 98.26 holding. Again, first target is going to be 83.88 on the longer term weekly chart and much lower below 55 here long term. So, all right, thanks for watching.